This is Mr. Brilliant, St. Elizabeth Catholic School. This is the fifth video in this series uh, sculpting. Um, this one, in this particular case, my student had an issue with the uh, leaving with the finished form. And I'll show you when I do that right now. And you'll see all, we have all this stuff pops up. And if you move this out of the way, you can see there's a problem in the front of the car. And, and there's also one at the back of the car, it's just you can't see it from this point. So here's how I fixed it, or how we, one, one of the ways we resolved it. I'm sure there's many different ways, but this is one of the ways. So click return close that out and the first thing I did is I went to the front view of the car and I touched on this in my last tutorial similar situation what I do is you highlight this whole thing and then we're going to go into modify flatten and these are all selected oh I deselected them that was a mistake select them again click OK and that'll flatten it and then the second thing we do is we weld it so we come in here we highlight this whole thing once again modify and then we weld and it's asking where you want to weld. Well, I'm going to weld all of that together. And now you can see it change shape a little bit. I'm going to click OK. And that particular one worked. Now, if I click Final Form, you see the back is going to be an issue now. And the back, the way we did the back, or the way they fixed the back, is I scroll around to the back of the car. And it's the way this is folded. It's kind of all folded up over top of one another and so on. So the way I fixed that is the same sort of situation. I highlight this that I went modify and basically it's over it's overlapped and I'm going to go to uh, flatten and when he flattens it you see what happened it opens up which is okay and then I'm just going to click okay and I flattened it and now we've got this gap so now to fix the gap you highlight that whole window there and you'll see it wrapped right around and then you go modify and then I went to fill hole which is here and I fill the hole and it opened it up and I click okay and now, if you come back, scroll out, and take a look, finish form, the car is finished form. It changed a little bit. Now, if, you, if you're not happy with the way it turned out, at least this is proper now, you could come back in here, of course, put some more edges and, and go back into continue modifying it. And the way to continue modifying, if you want to go back into the sculpt mode, is to simply come down here, and then you edit it, and now you're back into sculpt mode, and again, you can, you can come in and act, add some more things to it and, and continue modifying it. But that's how you finish it. Uh, whenever you get an, an issue like that, it means that something's overlapping. The other way to check things too, uh, I'll just quickly show you, is we go into, there's a couple ways. You can do it with quick keys. You can go Alt-1 and change it this way. Or, and then Alt-2 shows both the square, the, the uh, box shape and the round. And then Alt-3 is the round one. Or you can just go modify, sorry, you go into utilities and display mode and there's the different display modes. So this is the square and when you click on the square you look for it just shows you if something's overlapping or something looks funny and it gives you an opportunity to come in here and you can actually fix it in this mode as well and then go back into that mode if you like. So that's how you solve the problems. Maybe it's not going to solve every one of your problems but certainly it'll solve it solved this one and now we'll be able to 3D print this car.